In Collin County tonight, drivers in the town of Melissa say they're fed up with a construction project that's causing a huge traffic nightmare at 121 and Highway 5. And that's where Jobin Panicker is live tonight. And Jobin, you say police are calling this a crisis? Well, Cynthia, yeah, crisis is one where TxDOT came in here and changed the traffic pattern. The transition was not easy, and I'm sure if you asked the drivers, they would call it something else. Words we cannot use on air. It is an ever-changing landscape, the roads of Collin County. With progress comes change. And even when change comes with a sign, it still may not be enough. This widening project forces the 121 southbound lane into a two-way here in Melissa. There's a lot of moving parts in this uh, construction area. You can say that again. When TxDOT switched up the traffic pattern here on 121 and Highway 5 two weeks ago, it got ugly. There's been eight crashes here in the last two weeks. As ugly as the beat up barrels meant to help. Speaking of beat up, Patty Gardner certainly feels that way. I felt disoriented on a road that I usually know. It was like I was driving blind, literally. Home from the emergency room, Patty escaped this accident with bruises. Hers was one of the eight crashes that happened on this very small stretch. Sadly, one driver died on Friday. They should have already done something to avoid this, like way before my accident, way before the fatality happened. TxDOT says it has addressed safety, reduced the speed limit, set out detour signs, even put out these electronic message boards. TxDOT and its contractor are currently working with the Melissa Police Department to determine whether any additional steps can be taken to further highlight this change in the traffic pattern. We were there when police and TxDOT met. Well, anytime they change a the traffic pattern, it's a problem. A problem that may require an adjustment for all sides that use this road. Jobin Panicker, Channel 8 News.